Hello everyone. <clears throat> this is what I call a month-long mail call. I have uh, been gone out to the Pacific Northwest for three weeks. I left on the 6th of February. Today is the 29th. I returned home yesterday. So this is my uh, PGA package. Renewal. So I, I bought a bunch of stuff on eBay and other places, but I got my sticker, I got my new card, and 2024 member. I probably. Oh yeah, I, I'm extended beyond to 2025 already. I forgot. And my coupon for DGN, which I've already got that, so I'm good. All right, the rest is um, cards, I think, all. It's gonna be a bunch of a couple sets or one or two sets so it might be a little repetitive here we have a leaf art of sport ricky wysocki i cannot read three out of seven i think it's kind of pinkish magenta Got another one. That one sure looks like purple to me. It says two out of five. Man, the bottom edges are not good on those two so far. It's not a good sign. Not much I can do about it, but. Ricky W. Disc Golf, it says. That one. It's five out of seven. Sorry, just getting all the tape off so you can see it all. I guess I'll just put it into a new team sleeve later. Well, that one's better. There's no damage on the bottom there. Five out of seven or six out of seven. I don't have my glasses on. I can't read that. All right, so that's two of the pink ones. I think I got a deal on some of them. I bought a couple of a few, and I I maybe overpaid on the first ones that I bought. So when I saw the prices and the offers I made were much lower than when they were brand new, and here's another one out of seven. That one looks pretty decent on the bottom edge, too. That looks like... Wow, is that hard to read. Two out of seven. So I have three of the seven of those. All Leaf Art of Sport. Ricky Wysockis. Should be getting the uh, DGPT cards fairly soon, I think, and that's kind of going to be the point where I hope to start doing some breaks. Some will be things you can buy into, some won't. Um, here we have a blue, looks, wow. 
I'm not sure if that's the emerald or not. It's really kind of tealish. But I swore I got a green. Yeah, look at that color difference. Oh, that one's out of three. Green is out of three. Blue is out of four. All right. So we got three, four, five, seven. Three sevens, actually. What do I win if I get three sevens? I don't know. That could be something special. Another art of sport. Ricky Wysocki. 10 out of 35. Bronze colored. Okay. Wow. People are making all sorts of products to protect their cards. This is called the Ding Defend. And it's corrugated plastic. That will sure we keep something protected. Oh, I guess I bought two out of 35. That looks like a six to me. Another bronze. I need that one. I know that. I know what that is. And it's not related to these. Whoa, I am out of fourth one. Four out of seven. Uh, I think I overdid it. So I have four of the seven pink ones out of seven. Anyways, as I said a little bit ago, uh, once I get my 2024 DGPT cards in, I'm going to start doing some breaks. Uh, little mixers with Brixton. Uh, may do some by player. So you can pick a player. You can buy a player's slot and get all the cards from that player. Difficulty there is some players are only in Brixton, some are only in DGPT. So that'll make it interesting to figure out and how to price it and everything, but something I think thinking about doing. So this is a Leaf Vibrance uh, proof, unsigned proof, one of one on the back it says here. Sorry, you get a glare. Uh, one on one unsigned pre production proof with the matching serial number was used in the manufacturing process by Leaf. So that's where the auto would normally go. So that's the. Well, I guess I had a. I had an orange. I had an orange base one already. Interesting. The orange one has absolutely no... I don't want to break that open. <clears throat> so the green one has the reflection. The orange one does not. And as far as I know, it was straight reflection. Yeah, those are reflective. And then these were like a glimmer or shimmer. This was a red something special. This is glim shimmer, excuse me. So I'm not sure why there's a base or non-reflective one. Uh, I'm going to have to look into that. Anyways. On to the next package. I think I should take out my garbage from down here before my wife comes home from vacation. She's spending an extra week skiing and then has business in a different city. So 
she just stayed on the road for a bit. Here we have another emerald out of three. So I've got another one out of three. But it would be nice to get this basement cleaned up. Be nice to actually have it nice and clean for when I start doing breaks. I'm going to have to uh, finally organize all of these cards. I had them out for when I was showing everyone <coughs> <coughs> my collection, and they never really got put away. So, give me some thoughts on how you uh, store your cards. I've got top loaders I've got some in sleeves I got some in boxes like set boxes uh, what's the best way to organize everything I'm gonna need some help on that because I got so many different things here we have the 10 out of 15 art of sport so I got the 15 the 35 the 7 the 5 the 4 the 3 and I believe there were twos and ones. And maybe an eight or a nine. I don't remember. This one was a, a one of one, I believe. Yep. It is, this was an exclusive online only. Um... Leaf Metal X Rookie. Let me see if I, yep, I have those right here. So these were, I think this was an eBay exclusive. And this was a Whatnot exclusive. And those were numbered, guaranteed to be numbered out of four or two or something. This one's out of four, this one's out of two. And then this was the red one of one. Show you the back if you can see the one of one is right up above there if you get the right reflection. So doing pretty well on that one. Uh, so that was all the white stockies. This one was a gift from the man from DGPT himself because he had one and he knew I needed one. I only need one more of these 2023 DGPT um, foil, they were called from the DGPT. <coughs> Some people were calling them silvers and they're numbered, serial numbered out of 20. So I have 74 of the 75 card set and the only one that I need is last year's pro winner Isaac Robinson MPO so this is Ben Calloway uh, thank you Ty Tanit. Um, I think he was a local so I don't know if he pulled that from his own collection for me but I appreciate getting that one that was card 44th place. 50, 49, 48, 47, 46, 45, 44. Yep. Yeah. So Isaac Robinson, 2023 DGPT foil. I need you wherever you are. Somebody help me find it. I missed out on one I know of already. Um, that I saw or knew somebody had, but someone made him an offer that he could not refuse. All right. This, I paid a little bit for it. But I did it to bolster my inventory 
for my upcoming breaks and whatever I decide to do. So we've got two packs of 2020 DGPT, one pack of 2019, and three packs of 2017. So that's pretty cool. Um, you could get a Simon, you could get a Barella rookie. And the other thing that was included in this was a 2019 sealed box set. So anyways, I paid a little bit for that. Uh, I was okay doing it. Because I'm just trying to bolster this, the amount of variety that I have for my when I start doing these breaks. And that helped. Um, I've sold all of my older 2019s already, I think. I'd never bought any of the 2020s. Because all of the cards were available in the... Um, box sets so I didn't go after any of the the packs 2017 I haven't had packs in a long time and just another extra set here of 2019 so I think I've got three complete box sets but that's going to go with my 2021 packs I've also got packs from 2023 and I will have boxes coming for the 2024 DGPT. And I still have some Golden Era boxes. So let me know if you're into the DGPT cards. Um, if you want to keep the DGPT stuff separate from Brixton boxes. I'm really up for anything. I just want it to be a you know, good deal for you guys. And I want, hopefully... To be able to, <clears throat> what I want to do is I want to put a bounty on the couple of cards that I'm still looking for. So if I pull them, um, I guess I can't mandate that you sell it to me. But I, what I do is probably give you a heck of a deal <clears throat> if I, if you got the pack, like if you got the pack that had the card I needed. You might end up getting two extra packs or three packs or whatever it might be. Whatever's fair, but also um, enticing enough to you to want to make the trade with me to help me complete my set. I'm really close. I only need a couple of basket cases. Uh, actually, one basket case. I think I've got a trade worked out for the other one that I need. I need one Classics Gold, which is Albert Tom. I need Kona. I believe is the one that I have in a trade coming from the basket case and Kevin Jones is the only one that I know I don't have accounted for and then there's five royalty that I'm going for and four artifacts golds all the ones I have are Climo and Steady Ed so I don't have Ulibari, Ulibari, uh, Doss, Calvin or Drew Gibson. So, those are the only six cards that I need to complete everything I wanted to. Um, I didn't want to go for the one of ones. Because that's impossible. There's no way anyone could ever complete an entire one of one collection. But I did get one of each type of one of one in my packs that I opened already. So I counted that as good enough for me. So, anyways, definitely hit me up. Let me know what you want to do, um, what you want to see from these breaks when I get to them. Uh, I'm definitely going to wait until the 2024 DGPT <coughs> stuff shows up, but uh, I appreciate it. Please like, share, subscribe as you see fit, and uh, keep on collecting cards. That's it. Bye-bye.